right i'm just going to turn this around for me the fun of life there we go good afternoon and welcome i started this live before and there's one person watching i didn't know who it was so i do apologize but the phone rang i hadn't put in silent that's the fun of lives so i want to introduce today my really really exciting new center the livery center tlc so let me just show you the location first so Right behind me is the uh, Royal Mile heading down towards Hollywood. And if I just turn this around, get the finger out of the way, it's just going to actually go. There we go. So looking up there, that's looking up to the where the castle, up to the castle. So if I just turn this way, that's the Canning Gate, the Royal Mile, and just continue turning. And then when you actually just look down, going down that road there where those cars are going, that's just taking us down to the Hollywood Park. But where the livery centre is, is this street, Cranston Street. And that's it. You see those blue buildings? That's the livery centre, TLC. So from my last live, where I was able just to take the images from the outside, Today we're actually going to go inside because this is now my place. This is the Library Centre. This is where it's all going to happen. We're going to walk in through these doors that I've just walked in and just feel fantastic. Yes. So coming in through the doors, you would come, there's a few steps there, you'd come down the steps We'll just give a, a pan of what you'd see when you come in. It used to be a basement, seemingly, this place. And um, they, they've done it all out with different partitions and such like and made it absolutely fantastic. So I'm walking down these stairs, which will take us into a bit of a hiccup there because it's Jane. Hi, Jane there. It... Connection got lost as I was walking down into the reception area. So hopefully it keeps going as uh, I show everyone around the place. David. Hi, David. So what we've done is we've walked in through the front door and down these steps. Okay. So I'm going to the back of the steps. But walking into this area here, which is the going to be like the reception area and straight ahead there that's going to be one of the treatment rooms I'll just go in not that you can see much you can see I've already got my junk in there because it's the warmest room in the house to begin with but this is a lovely little area it's going to be one of the the rooms this black bookshelf thing will be taken out it's lovely and cozy in here so this will be able to be used for, I think we can get a massage couch in, I don't know, we'll soon find out. So we're just walking back out of this small room. Shut the door, keep the heat in, because there's not been anybody in here since October, so it's, it's quite chilly. And this particular area here is this door here. Not very good at these lies. I hope everybody can understand what I'm doing here. Into the kitchen. So the kitchen... It's, it's quite big, it's, it's perfect. You know, it's got a fridge, benches and things. Um, these windows, hey, hey Jock, love to see you. This, there's a window there, I'm gonna have to see, you know, covering up, up like all the windows, cause it's a bit like being in a goldfish bowl, to be honest. Um, and then, well, there's a sink there. So it's, it's ample, it's ample for being able, for anybody who works here to be able to bring your pat lunch and you know pop it in the fridge there or, or make up your own sandwiches or some such and you can see how they've kept all the stonework the original all stonework um, and the beams there it all gives part of the the atmosphere and through here it's the, the kitchen door there so you can get a, an idea of where we are through here uh, this is the loos I suppose I might as well better show no reason why not. I hope you can actually see what's going on here. Right, here we go. There's one loo. And we've got two loos. 
fantastic, isn't it? Is there somebody in there? No. I think we're going to have to do a little bit of do-it-yourself there. Unless, of course, we have a ghosty locked themselves in the loo. That's quite possible. It is an old-fashioned um, building, isn't it? So coming again, well, we're going to go into Studio One. Right. So Studio One is actually quite large. This is the largest of the studios. You can hear the, the hollow sounds. And I've got two... There's night story sheets in here, and they've only been on for doing a couple of hours, and it's really quite warm in here. It's super. But you can see drop lights and um, laminate flooring. Fantastic place for yoga, exercise, events, anything. So we'll walk out of here, shut the door behind us, keep the heat in. And we're going to walk into the next part because what the Library Centre here is, is two, two buildings, number three and number five. So this is the next one. This is going to be Studio Two. I want some, some doors put up here so there will be a self-contained studio. It's a little bit smaller, but it's got the length that will be able to be, you know, fill at the same capacity. And once the doors are on, I'll probably come to about here, because there's no reason why we can't, you know, just put, put doors just right there. Can, can, is that, I don't think I'll ever make a film director, would I? And we'll turn here, just put some doors up where all, that sort of cupboardy type thing is, which we'll get rid of. The second treatment room that we can use, we need to get a door, because somebody's gone and acquired the door off it, is here, which is a really good decent sized one, this. Uh, night storage heaters all over the place. The window here, obviously, can't stay like that, but what I thought would be quite nice there is a water feature that fills the whole window and comes, I, I, just ideas, but it's certainly a good, a good space, you know, wonderful, beamed areas and then we go into even more space through this door here we go and this actually has another door going out and a nice little cozy area another window what I want to do with this area is to make it into ah right we're back again the signal was lost there. Oh, well, Jack and David, it's nice to see you're still here. Obviously, O2 doesn't like it down here in the, the old town. I had to bring, come back up to the, the front door. So I'll be very quick and show you this, this next area. What I was saying is that I want to use this as a lounge area so people after their treatments can come and just relax. So I'm going to be very quick because in case it goes off again, we'll walk through. Um, I'm just going to go back through here because this is where it keeps switching off. This is going to be the lounge area. I might cordon off the bottom here, the bottom bit, and make this into a therapy room because there is the space. Now I'm going to turn around from where I've just come from so that you can see I'm walking right to the back of the wall here that all this area here most of this area here will be the lounge area for people to come in and sit down and just chill there will be books there there'll be magazines and you can stay for as long as you like because the body's still processing after having a treatment and it needs that time to recuperate and then just go out through this door so by going out through this this back door or this other door it means that the work that's going on in these other treatment rooms aren't being disturbed so there's lots of potential lots of space tons of ideas going through my head I'm actually quite knackered at the moment because it's been a long day I've been visiting different bits and pieces and this excitement, this cumulation of just getting it all together, it's it's just been great. So that's that's the second studio, the one that I was saying I would like to I want to get some doors up. We're gonna go back into the main area, which if I just pan around, you can see they've kept this beams 
They've kept the old stonework. They've brought out the features of, of the beams there. And the whole, the whole ambience of the place is just, I think, perfect for, for what is going to be going on. So hopefully, um, well, never mind, but hopefully, um, I know that David will be seeing you here and Jock too. I'm sure you'll come up and visit along because it lost signal again. I've got an organized BT here, so it should be um, better. I'll be able to use their wireless. So there we go. This is a back up here. You'll be able to see the outside. For anybody who's not actually seen the video that I made previously showing the outside of the premises. Just walking up here, that's just one part of it. And then walking down here, that is the whole of the premises. Right, we'll just turn back to me. There we go. So, there we go. That's the Library Centre, the TLC, officially today. So I am now officially a holistic entrepreneur. Right, any questions? Just file them to me. There will be lots and lots more lives. And thank you guys for being there. Thank you for watching. Catch you later. Bye-bye.